you, uh, through you to the member from Kingston and the Islands. Uh, palliative care is where the emphasis should be. And that can totally take care. I'm talking to uh, people that have been in, in distress. They are able to manage the pain uh, mentally and physically. Now, but this bill, this amendment, doesn't talk so much about medical assistance in dying, but it talks about for people that are not dying. And so this is what we're talking about in this, this amendment is unfettered expansion of euthanasia, of assisted suicide, like seen nowhere else in the world. This is, a, this is a, a very deep concern, because right now there are 4,000 people that die from suicide each year. 7% of those that, are, that make attempts actually do die from it. This will allow many, many more, thousands more a year to actually accomplish suicide. Right now, and I'm just going to mention this quick point, uh, three times more men are actually commit suicide than women, though two times as many women make the attempt. We're finding through MAID that two times more people are actually going through that are women. And so this is really impacting women also. And I just want to ask the question to the member, you know, does she find it uh, perverse that, that what is being offered is, is death prior to treatment? Because uh, that is what's necessary and that is what is lacking. 